Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the title of this video, today will be an unboxing video of my new Hermes notebook cover. And yeah, I'm really excited. This is my second time filming this because the lighting in my previous video was really bad. So I've already opened this and unboxed it. And if you guys follow me on Instagram at jwongdesigns underscore, then you would have already seen the unboxing because I do everything live on there. So if you guys want to keep up to date with all the latest things that I'm posting about with regards to planners, stationery and luxury accessories, please give me a follow and you'll be more up to date on the day to day things than on the YouTube uh, channel. So yeah, so let's begin. I basically I've unboxed this already and I just tied the ribbon myself. That's why it looks so crappy because I DIY'd wrapped it again just to give you guys the full experience but yeah I'm really excited to show you guys what I got um, this is a very expensive purchase with regards to planners it's not as expensive as some of my previous luxury planner uh, purchases but it still really is up there I've been thinking about this purchase for a very long time and I've always wanted one but I think it's just the whole like Hermes branding thing and then like um, going into a store and all that all that kind of stuff that kind of kept me away from um, purchasing the planner but um, yeah recently I moved to a new city I got a new job and I've been here for a while now and I've been in and out of the store and I met a really great sales associate who is actually really nice and very helpful and um, I've been just like texting her for other things um, like helping my mom buy scarves and like and stuff like that and stuff for myself as well and um, I, I think I built up a really good relationship with her so when I texted at her the other day asking inquiring about the Ulysses notebook um, she was very helpful she texted me back right away she's like look we do have one but it's in gold um, and then I was asking her about the dimensions and she wasn't sure about the size so that's why she was like why don't you just come in make an appointment and then we can look at it together and you can bring in whatever notebooks you want to try fitting in it and seeing if you actually like it so I was just like yeah that sounds great I made the appointment thinking I would I was just going in just to look at the uh, the dimensions of an agenda and then I end up purchasing an agenda so let's get right into it first I'm gonna unbox this this right here is the insert for the notebook and it just comes with a ribbon like this and it's interesting to me because this is the first time I noticed that the ribbon itself says Hermes 2021 so I've never noticed that before um, I'm not even sure if the previous ribbons say the year on it but I think that's really nice and it also is like kind of like a nice um, thing to keep to remind myself of when I purchased this agenda so I'm just gonna put this aside and the box for the notebook cover comes like this over here it is sealed and when you open it up it's like a book so here it is so here's the agenda very beautiful it is your typical kind of a disc bound um ring notebook the only difference is it has this little attachment piece which is what you use to attach the notebook into your leather planner very interesting type of structure the notebook that i chose it comes with this kind of clear acetate um, logo uh, white logo front and then the inside I chose to have um, the blank sheets of paper. And the reason why I chose the blank sheets of paper is because I feel like it's more versatile. And then for someone like me who loves to customize agendas, I feel like this is perfect for me. I can use this either as a bullet journal, as a notebook, like a regular notebook for journaling, or I can use it for memory keeping. And to have blank pages, I feel like that's very useful for my purposes because if I'm gonna paste in a photo or something, it's not gonna look too weird with existing lines. So this is very, very versatile versatile for me I can even draw in this and I love how thin and lightweight all the pages are they are a little bit see-through but I've already figured out a way of customizing this notebook and I'll be showing you how to do that um, at the end of this video so here it is let me just set this aside and then for the piece de resistance the actual um, notebook itself so let me give you a background story when I went in um, obviously as I told you guys before she said that she only had it in the color gold um, I wasn't like totally in love with that color though like when I went in to see it I, I was trying it out just to see for the dimensions but she said that was the only one in stores so we were looking and I was like are you sure there's like nothing else um, 
in the uh, notebook section that I would be interested in. So she did really help me out and she went into all the drawers and she was like looking everywhere. She's just like, no, I don't see anything. There's nothing else here. And she was like pulling boxes. She did, however, pull out a different type of notebook cover. And that one was beautiful. It is a tri-color um, smooth leather, leather agenda. And um, basically it didn't have the inserts available. And that's ultimately why I did decided not to buy it because it was just the agenda itself and also at the same time the pricing of that was ridiculous it was like a thousand like over a thousand dollars and it was really beautiful and I think that that one is a very versatile piece as well that I would actually use um, but it wasn't exactly what I was looking for that day and also at the same time the pricing I just wanted like a notebook cover the pricing had to be good and then something that I would be falling in love with which they didn't have so I'll insert a clip of the two agendas that she showed me right now in this video so you guys can kind of like have that experience of what I felt so yeah two really beautiful pieces and the colors are amazing for those as well but it wasn't exactly what I was looking for so when I was playing around with the ULCs which is like the brown colored one that I showed you don't look I was just like are you sure there's like no other color like I would prefer something like more bright more fun so immediately she went on her little cell phone and then she pulled up like a stock list and she went through and she's like, wait a minute, I think maybe I'll have something at the back. And then she like disappeared for a while. And then she came back with this. And when she came back with this, she was already like, I think you're going to like this one because it's like one of your top leather colors that you've mentioned before. And I think you're going to like this one. It's a bright color. Um, she told me the color before she opened the box. So then I already had like in my head, wow, this would be amazing. But when I opened it, I was in love. So let's have a look. Wow, my tying skills. <laughs> so this is basically what it comes in. It comes in a big, nice, good quality box. When you open it up, it comes in the typical tissue. This is the same kind of tissue that like Birkins, Kelly's, like all those fancy bags come in as well. And the way they wrap it is the same. Obviously I've already unboxed it, so I like rewrapped it myself, but here is the agenda that she presented me with. Look at this. This is in Togo leather. It is in the color Rose Mexico, and it is absolutely stunning. I can't even like describe the color to you guys. And the color kind of changes depending on um, the lighting as well. Right now, I'm right beside a window. Uh, this is my second time trying to film this because when I tried to film this in my kitchen, everything looked yellow. So you could not appreciate the full beauty of the leather quality and the color. But this is how it looks like. This is in Rose Mexico and is absolutely beautiful. So let me just put this aside so I can give you guys more details. It's in the MM size, and this is called the Ulysses Notebook Cover. The inside looks like this. It's literally just like a big sheet of leather. The inside is unfinished. It is in the raw leather, which is fine. It's still very durable. They actually have bags like this. I think the Picotin is like also raw leather on the inside. That's that little bucket bag that you see people using. Um, it has like the little Hermes Paris um, logo over here, and then the two snap buttons for the agenda, uh, or sorry, the notebook itself so how you put the agenda in or sorry how you put the insert in is you basically line up the snap buttons to go like this and then it fits perfectly and what I love about this agenda is that it's very lightweight the inserts themselves are very lightweight the cover itself is just a thin piece of leather so overall the construction of it is very user-friendly I guess it's very lightweight and practical it's not like you're lugging around something really really heavy especially given the size the back of it looks like this it has two little Hermes button snaps and if you zoom in really closely you could also see that um, it has the logo on it Hermes Paris but whatever that's just like a minor detail but overall I'm very happy with the purchase it's just like so beautiful I wish you guys can feel this it feels amazing the quality and everything and it's just very very luxurious so this is my unboxing for my Hermes Ulysses agenda this is pretty much the whole video is just an unboxing but I will be showing you some short clips later to show you guys how to customize it as well I hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, subscribe for more videos on how I'm gonna be customizing this agenda as well you can hit the like button if you enjoy this kind of content and I will hopefully be posting more I've been very very busy with my new job I've been working very long hours and barely having time to film right now today is my actual vacation day that I took off for um, Chinese New Year so that's why I'm not in the office right now and there's actually so 
sunlight out during the day, which is nice because usually I go into work at like 8.30 and I leave at 8.30 p.m. Sometimes um, I don't see daylight at all. So this is a very rare occasion for me to be able to film, but like here it is absolutely spectacular so let me just show you guys really quickly i figured out a way to punch holes um onto little postcards and stuff um this one didn't turn out that great because of the postcard quality i got this postcard from cloth and paper and as you can see in the areas where i did punch it it's starting to look a little disheveled so it's not i, I wouldn't recommend punching this kind of texture of card um, to become inserts into this um agenda or into this notebook sorry i keep calling it a, an agenda because i'm honestly going to be using it kind of like a memory keeper agenda but yeah anyways i figured out how to punch uh holes and i'll be showing you guys clips of how i do that um after this video but basically after you are able to punch holes um you can cut little slits within whatever you want to insert and you can just pop it into the notebook into the rings so you can do some customization if you like I've also seen online that people customize this notebook by completely um, using a different type of notebook. So see, it flips perfectly fine. Um, but as I was saying, sorry, um, I've seen people also customize this notebook by replacing the notebook that they purchase with a agenda, a dated agenda. And all they do is they take this piece and they slip it out of the rings and then they slip it into the rings of the agenda that they purchased. So that's another way that you can um, customize and use a different insert rather than the one that comes from Hermes. So the insert itself is like $80 and the um, planner agenda, depending on what country you're in, um, it's around $500. Mine was like $480 um, and then including tax and stuff, it ended up as like $500. So I was really, I, pr I was pretty happy about that because um, I thought that this was going to be $500 before tax, but it ended up being like $500 after tax. And then obviously it was more because I purchased the insert as well but you don't have to actually purchase the insert you can find your own notebook but i just wanted it for my pr first purchase to actually have the insert as well absolutely stunning absolutely beautiful so that's that that is my video i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll talk to you guys in the next one remember to subscribe and also follow me on instagram if you want current up-to-date updates and now let's move on to kind of sort of the um show and tell of what punch i'm using and all of that. Also, I wanted to show you guys my SA also gifted me this beautiful pack of red envelopes for Chinese New Year from Hermes. And it comes with like a pack of 10 and it's just absolutely amazing. These ones are actually very interesting because the little cows themselves, the gold, you can actually scratch it off with a coin and it reviews like a prosperity um, message in it. I've seen it online. I personally am not going to scratch any of these. I feel like I want to keep it all pristine and beautiful, but I thought I would show you guys this as well um, since it is Chinese New Year and yeah, I mean we celebrate like pretty much the whole month or the whole week so yeah this is how their ones look like I thought I would show you guys that as well very gracious amazing that she actually gave me this as well since I'm not like a VIP but anyways very cool she told me that these are offered and you cannot request for them but um, she managed to get me a pack anyways so cool I thought I would share that to you guys as well so yeah there it is Okay, so I decided to do a voiceover for the punch. This is the punch that I'm using right now for um, making the holes to slip little inserts into the notebook. This is from We Are Memory Keepers and it's very customizable because they give you little individualized hole punches which you can line up to the ruler that is at the very bottom depending on what type of notebooks you want to use this for. So this is super versatile and it's amazing because it can work on any planner. So basically any type of planner you have you can create little holes for it. So that's really great. So basically what I did was I mapped out where the dots were. I wrote down which dimensions they were and then I punched it. So those are the dimensions for the notebook. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing video of my new Hermes Ulysses notebook. And yeah, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and remember to subscribe for more video and content soon. You can also follow me on Instagram for the latest updates.